Hey guys, it's Mike here. We're in front of Lake Washington. The temperature of the lake is about 52 degrees. And every other night we've been coming out here and going hiking and afterwards it's our routine to get into the water for as long as we can. And that's usually until my neck hurts or my arms are totally numb. So I'm gonna show you how to do that. And I'm sure you have a lake or a river or a stream near your home and you can make a habit of this. And this will increase your stress resilience, uh, enable you to burn fat better, activate brown fat. And overall it's just good for circulation. I've had some injuries with my arm and my pec and back and all that. So I'm just trying to be creative with my workout. So I'm gonna show you what it looks like. So the trick is, uh, you want to get in as fast as you can, and that's going to kind of activate your barrel response and get into about your chest height so you get your neck and everything and just kind of move your limbs around so that you're moving your lymphatic system, moving your blood. Stay in as long as you can. I, the longest I made it was three and a half minutes and I, my whole body started to get numb. But it's actually kind of peaceful once you get in here, you know, because your body gets so cold that the water doesn't even feel really cold anymore because your skin is actually numb. Now I know that I was dropping my body temperature because the back of my neck, it's hard to kind of move my neck and my whole body's stiff and you can see the goosebumps and uh, I can feel a deep chill. So that's how I know I dropped my body temperature and uh, it's actually hard to talk <laughs> right now. So these are all good things. These are adaptations, just like when you uh, do public speaking, um, you know, when you run hard, when you do sprints, when you do high intensity interval training or weight training, you're causing your body to adapt, to be stronger for that next event. And so by reducing your core body temperature, what you actually activate is brown fat. And this is the fat that's on the back. Um, it, well, it's, it's under our arms, uh, around the trapezius rhomboid area, and it, act, it helps you to burn fat better. So brown fat, um, it's biochemically different than, than the white fat and, uh, and uh, visceral fat in our body. Basically what it does is it has this uncoupling protein and it takes stored energy and converts that into heat instead of making ATP. So you can burn fat better and uh, it, uh, it's good overall. This is a huge target in metabolic research right now. So give that a shot, comment below and you can subscribe to the channel if you wanna learn more cutting edge tips to help you burn fat better and stay lean. Thanks for tuning in.